Hello. Hello, teacher. How are you? Fine. Hello. <laughs> cool. Hello. Hi. Hello. Welcome back. Hello. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks how a lot. Was, how was the weekend? Uh, it's fine. Weekend was fine. Very okay. fine. Okay. Fine. Did you go anywhere? Yes. Okay. I came to San Miguel to visit oh. to my family. <laughs> okay. Good. Did you go alone? No. I'm here with my wife. Oh. So did you catch the bus or did you drive? We drive. Okay. Good. All right. So um, what about the others? How was the weekend? Good. I was visit my mom. Good. Where? Very good. Uh, in Colonia Miramonte. Okay. Good. Yes. Good. So, good. So she lives there. Yes. Good. She and my and my brother too. All right. Your yes. older brother or younger brother? My younger brother. All right. How old is he? He's twenty five. Yes. Uh, yes. Very young. Mm, yes. No. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry no. yes. How old are you? 34. 34? Yes. All right. Good, good. And, and where do you live, Mr. Serrano? In, do you know Quinta San Antonio? Mm, San Antonio. Santa Tecla. No, que Saltepec. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. I know it's near San Gabriel. Oh yes, yes, sure. Okay, Next to San Gabriel. All right, good, good, good. All right, so today is May the fourth. Uh, if today is the fourth, what was yesterday? Third. 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 What was Saturday? Second. Second. And Friday? Oh, 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 oh second. <laughs> first. 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 And what do we celebrate May 1st? Labor Day? Labor Day. Labor Day. Day. Labor Day. Labor Day. Labor Day. Labor Day. Yes. Yeah. Labor. Labor. Labor Day. Yes. All right. So today is the fourth. Uh, do you remember the activities we did on Thursday? Yes. What were the topics? Uh huh. What were the topics? Uh, I don't remember so so clearly, but I remember a little conversation about uh, Steve and Maria. Uh, this this topic is what's read about. Uh, let me see. <laughs> Uh -huh. Someone can help uh, Alan? What was the conversation sure. about? The conversation was about the, uh, a birthday gift, a, a journey. Uh huh. Yes. All right. That's about, mm -hmm. about the prison for a, for a birthday, right? Right. Yes. And, and mm -hmm. where was the conversation? And a store, in a couple, oh, in or a store. in a mall. I, I mean, what store? Jewelry. Jewelry. Yeah, a jewelry store. Jewelry. Yeah, jewelry store. What do people sell in a jewelry store? Uh, earrings. Earrings. Necklaces. Okay. Anything that is related with jewelry: earrings, necklace. Bracelet, uh, gold, silver, and all that. Okay. Um, do you have any questions about Thursday? No? No, no. I have a question. Yes, uh, Pamela. We've been talking about a past participle. Uh -huh. And I need to know if um, the regular verbs are 
reading the same as in simple past? Yes, uh, that's a very good question. Um, in English, we have regulars and we have irregular verbs. Um, when we have irregulars, like go, went, gone, write, wrote, written, come, came, come, uh, the three forms, uh, usually they change when they are irregulars. Now, when they are regulars, the same ED that you have in the simple past is the same ED that you have in the past participle. Okay. Yes. Any other questions? No? Okay. So for you to put that into practice, I'm going to assign you to be working in pairs. Um, and you will tell your friend the different activities you did Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and all day today. So Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and all day today. Are you ready? Teacher, teacher, can you can you repeat please? Because I, I couldn't hear you. Sure, sure. My interns. Sure. A little brown. <laughs> Um, I was telling everybody that uh, I'm going to assign you uh, to be working in pairs so yeah. you guys can tell each other the different activities you did Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and today. Okay. Yes. So let me get this here. Breakout room, 14 people, seven pairs. Uh, 13, 6, and here we go. Claudia, what did you do on Friday? Bueno. Hola. Claudia. Hola. How was Hi. Saturday? Uh, good. What I, did you do? I uh, spent time with my husband and son. Okay. Okay. Wow. Friday, okay. only I started with my with my children all day. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Um, yeah. I started with my family. Okay, thank uh -huh. you. Um, on Saturday, Saturday, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm working all day. Okay. So, yeah. Um, so I am. Uh, uh, <laughs> Look, I took a And you? On Saturday. I'm staying in my house with my boyfriend and we, I cooked um, fried chicken. No, now I understand. understand. Now I understand better. 
No, no, I, I don't think that I am not, I don't have a, a really good English, but I, I, I do the better. <laughs> yes. I try so hard, far. <laughs> Hi, teacher. Hello, how are you doing? How about your weekend? Um, Saturday, I went to teach, not exactly teach, but the week before, I have given them an exam. So, um, so last Saturday, I had to return, go over the exam, give them the grade, and if they agreed, they will sign the, the exam with their name and their signature. So it was only two hours, so it was kind of quick. So, and then Sunday I was here, and today I went out, um, because on Saturday I was supposed to leave the exams there at the institution, but I forgot. So I received a text message saying, look, Francisco, you forgot the exams. So I told him, look, um, I'm going to be there on Monday and I'll return them to you then. So that's the reason why I went back today. Oh, a lot of activities. Yeah. 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 A lot uh, of activities. Yeah. And then I went to my, uh, to my other job to get uh, a charger for the computer. So I got the newspapers, like three newspapers, and I came back to the house. So in my weekend, I have I I have been I have been looking for a for a headset to buy a, a headset online uh -huh. because I need a headset to 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 job from home. Right. <laughs> to work for to work from home. Excuse me. Right. Right. Yes. Right. And did you find them? No, I couldn't find. It. Okay. I couldn't find it, so I'm still looking. Okay. So I will start maybe in two two days coming soon. My my new job. Okay. Did right. you did you remember, teacher, that I wrote you on on weekend, uh -huh. uh, asking for a for something because I I had an interview the last uh, Saturday. Right in the right. afternoon, and and I pass it, yeah. Oh, good. I get good. I get hired, yeah, good, for for a pic, for an enterprise that is called Pixel Sourcing. It's an account in English. Okay, good, good. So you're gonna be doing home office. Yes, I'm going. <laughs> I will be going in home office. Okay, good. Yes. And, and that's gonna be in office hours. Uh, yeah, it's kind of office hours. It's gonna be from or since 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. with three with three breaks. Okay, so that's a six-hour uh, job. Five hours. Five hours. Five, yeah. five hours working. Yeah. Yeah, that that could be taken as a, as a part-time job. Maybe yeah, this it's can it's can be taken like a like a part time job. Yeah, yeah. Okay, all right, good. And, and where are the headquarters in San Salvador? Yeah, in San Salvador. Okay, good, good. All right. But so. but, but this this account is working for a, a janitor a janitor selling enterprise. Okay. Uh, how you say uh, labores sanitarios? Um, janitor labors, right? Yeah, labors. Janitor labors. Janitor labors, right? That is, a, a, I will to appoint or to take the appointments for the people who wants this enterprise for clean these uh, his his office or or his houses. Okay, all right, and that's gonna be in Spanish. No, it's gonna be it, uh, all in English. Okay, all so, English. So the janitors are in the states. Yeah, are in the states on in the United States or, or whatever country on the world. That oh. is but the but the enterprise is from United States. Okay. All right. Good for you. Thanks. <laughs> All right. Let's return to the main session. Okay. Okay. See you. 
divertido. All right, did you finish talking? Yeah. Okay. Now, um, how much have you worked in the platform? In the platform? Yes, how much have you worked? What kind of platform are you talking about? <laughs> uh, the, the platform, the INSA4 uh, platform. Ah, I okay. Less I than have... 3.7. Okay, 3.7, so that's unit three, if I'm not mistaken. Andy? No, uh, no 3.8, excuse me. 2.8. I'm in the section five of the section, of the sec yeah, I'm in the section five on. Okay, so you are going kind of fast. A little. All right. Okay, anybody else? What are you doing? Uh, where in the platform are you at this moment? Uh, teacher, I am in the 3.8. 3.8? 3.8. .8. 3 .8. I All think right. I, I am in the, in the class of today. I don't know. Okay, good, good. Just, just remember that by the time we finished, you should have 80% of all the work. So it doesn't matter which areas you're doing or you're not doing, at the end, you should have 80% of all the work. All right, um, so the reason why I was asking you is because, um, let me share this here. Okay, so hold on. Hold on. All right. Now, do you remember this? Do you see the image? Yes. Yes. All right. What's the name of the image? Demonstrative. All right. How many demonstratives do we have? Two. How many demonstratives do we have? Four. Four is correct. What are the name of those four? Mm, this. Uh huh. This, that, and those. And one more. This, this, that, this, that, those. All right. This, that, these, and those. Those. So look at the look at the first uh, uh the first three questions. How much is this necklace? How much is that necklace? How much is this one? How much is that one? Which one? The blue one. Now, do you remember the function of one and ones? What's the function of one or ones? To talk about things in general. Okay, in general or something or making reference to something that you previously said? Uh, sure. In we talk one by singular and once to plural. Okay, good. One is for singular and once is for plural. So if I said, is that your car? You will say, which one? One is making reference to the word uh, car. Now look at the second question. How much are these earrings? How much are those earrings? Which ones? How much are these? How much are those? And then when the person asks which ones, then you say the yellow ones. Now the yellow ones, the word ones is making reference 
to the word earrings. Are there any questions there? So if I said, where is your book? And you say, which one? What is one making reference to? The book. The book. That is correct. What if I said, uh, did you buy the shoes? And then you say, which ones? What is ones making reference to? Shoes. Shoes. Right. So whenever you use the word one, is to make reference to something singular that was already mentioned. When you say once, you're making reference to something plural that has been previously mentioned as well. Are there any questions or comments there? No. All right, so let me ask you, how do you use this? When do you use this? When the object is near. And, and close to you. Yes. When the object is near or close to you and it's singular. When do you use that? When the object is near and plural. It's uh, far in, in singular. Okay, far and singular. And singular. Car and singular. Yes. So how much is that one? When you're saying that one, you're making reference to something that is singular, but it's far. So that will be basically the main difference between this and that. This is for singular, that is for singular. This is used when something is near you, and that is when something is far from you. Is that clear? Yes. Okay. Now, what's the difference between these and those? Uh -huh. Can someone refresh my memory? Both are for, for object uh, in plural. Uh -huh. But this is an object near to you or close to you. Okay. So, uh -huh. The things that are Okay. Very good. Someone else wants to give it a try? Okay, so like uh, like our friend said, those is for something plural that is far from us, and these is something plural that is... Hold on. All right, uh, can you hear me? Yes, yes. Right. yes. So these going. is for plural and near us, and those is for plural far from us. So these is for plural, those is for plural. Those is far from you, these is near from you. Are there any questions? No. No? Any questions or any comments? No. No? All right, so let's um, let's check this here. 3.4, knowledge check. All right, can you see the screen? Yes. Yes. Okay, can I have a volunteer to read the instructions, please? Look at the picture below and complete this conversation using demonstrative one, one. Okay, so here we go. 
where is this conversation? Where is this conversation? In a clothes store. At the store. Okay, what kind of store? Department store. Department store. Okay, a department store. Okay, so look at the first question. Excuse me, how much? Those. Are those. Are those. Are those. Are those. Okay, are those jeans? Which ones? Which one? Which are? Uh, which ones? Ones. Okay. Let's click on one. Uh, do you mean this? No. The light blue. Ones. 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 Singular or plural? Plural. Plural. Okay. So let's click on plural. Oh, they, they, oh, are. they are, they are, okay, so let's check the second one, uh, I like that backpack over there, how much is it, is it, is it, is it, which one, the red one, red one. the red one, Okay, it's twenty-seven fifty, but the green wow. one. The green ones. Singular or plural? Singular. Singular. All right, yeah. singular. All right. So let's send it. Correcto. All right. Any questions with this exercise? No. No. All right. So I let's know. um. Let's go to the stress. Do you remember the meaning of the word stress? Uh -huh. What is what is the meaning of the word stress? Tilde or acento. Yes. Tilde or acento. Yes. So look at this here. All right. So listen and practice. Notice that the important words in a sentence have more stress. How would you pronounce sentence number one? Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. What about the second one? They're perfect. They're perfect. They're perfect. They're what about perfect. number three? I like, I like the blue, the blue one. one. I like the blue one. And the last one? They are they're not very attractive. attractive. Uh huh. They're not they're very attractive. attractive. Now, why is the stress important when you are speaking? Why is it important to have the right stress when you are speaking? It's a question. Repeat, please. Why is the sentence stress important in a question? Uh huh. What What if I tell you, venga mi casa? Do you say casa or casa? Casa. Casa. What happens if I say casa? There's no sense. Yeah, there, there is no sense. It doesn't make any sense. And people might understand what you're saying, but they will be saying or they will be thinking uh, things about your, your stress. And people in the United States, sometimes they're very... Uh, they discriminate maybe when they hear that you're not speaking the way you should. So that's why you need to expose yourself as much as possible to the language. Now, how do you acquire the correct stress? Uh, listening? Uh-huh. Yeah, listening. listening or, or, or 
Yeah. Yep. Yep. Any other suggestions of how to improve your stress? The pronunciation. Right, right. You have to practice as much as possible. You also have to practice listening. Uh, and, and, and if you want to improve your stress, you know, uh, you don't necessarily need to speak. I mean, at the end, that's, that's what you should be doing. But for you to acquire the, the correct stress, it's, it's, it's always good to practice listening. Any other suggestions or questions? No? All right, so let's, um, let's do this here. Do you see that page? Yes. Yes. All right. Okay, hold on. Okay. Now this one here. Let me see. See this here. Let me see. Check this picture. Let's see if it matches. Yes. Match nine to ten. Nine to ten. Right there. Did you receive the image? Yes. 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 All right. So I'm going to assign you to be working in pairs again. And um, so you can practice the language. Here we go. Will you want to begin? Okay. Those books right there, right here, are mine. Are mine? Yes. No, 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 no. Wait, wait. Yes, it's those, right? Those no, books. Because right. you said right, right here. Oh, um, no. This? No, no, this is this, this. because it's broad and near from us, right? Exactly. In this you say right here. Yeah, this, this book right here are mine. And those stores across the street sell clothes. Just eight? Books. Plural. Those books. Those books. Which number are you doing? The sentence is eight. Okay. So you said these or those? Those. No. Books. Are you sure? I don't know. Those are 
this near? These books. Uh -huh. These books. These books. These books. Because they are close. Exactly. And nine. The six. These. Okay. Or this. Are okay. the it's shoes good. I like. I like. It sería this. These are the shoes I like. Pero this, es que no. This. no. ¿Ah? Sería this, el plural. No, this, this. Yes. This are the shoes I like. Uh -huh. Ok. Pero si sí es singular. Pero como son en plural, this, this are the shoes I like. This, this. Entonces, this. 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 Y el otro es this. Ok, this singular. This singular. This es casi lo mismo, solo que es this. This no. singular. And okay. this. When it's, when it's singular, you say this. It's an this, S. Yes. This, it's a, this. Uh, this. This, yes. If it's plural, it sounds it's like this. a C. So this, like, like, these. Uh, okay. This. 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 Yes. Hmm. Okay. These. This. These shoes. These are the shoes I like. These are the shoes these. I like. Yes. Mm -hmm. these Very good. Are the shoes I like. Okay. Very good. Uh, the number seven, seven is that. 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 That store. That store across the yes. street sells. Those uh, students or dear are my friends. Yeah. Those those stands. My favorite very good. Uh, would you like some of this? Those years at the lake were the best times of my life. That is the way I would like to buy. These are absolutely delicious. Uh, sorry. <laughs> um, ¿Cuál era? Ah, ok, ok. So, ahí hay, hay, que, hay que entender como, como, como si están... Porque puede ser a la Aquí. derecha, cerca o lejos, va, pero o sea... Ok, sí, sí. No vemos, ¿Y pero quién lo dice? Ah, uh, sí. So right boots, here, right, right here. here I mean. Uh, eso, sí, that. Right, right here, que están cerca de ellos. Ok, eh, es this, correcto. This. No. This. Do, this those, book right here. Those books right here, my. Está no, refiriéndose es, a la derecha y lo está eh, que son de él. Ah, pero, pero sí como, se está refiriendo dice, a un lugar. Pero, no, pero como dice, los libros a la derecha eh, aquí. This right here. Teacher? Como que aquí. Ok, tenemos esta duda. ¿Cómo sería? Book right, la, right here, right here my. Which, which number? Which number? Eight, uh, number eight. eight. Number eight. Okay. Number eight. Uh, these books right here are mine. Right here. Uh -huh, yeah. Porque these está diciendo right acá. Here. Entonces los acá. tiene cerca. Uh -huh. Right here. O sea, uh -huh. como le dijo acá. Uh -huh. Are mine. Okay. Uh -huh. Right here. Right here. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. Books right here. Here. Right here. These books. Yes. Uh -huh. yes. 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 It's this. Okay. Okay. Fine. Number, Have you finished? Yes. Okay, no more speaking. <laughs> how was how was your no. weekend? How was your weekend? 
So, so. Teacher, how to say dolor de vientre? I have pain in my womb. Womb. Yes, I have pain in my womb. Okay. In my womb. Yes, in my womb. W-O-M-B. Okay, yesterday I have pain in my womb. Oh, okay. Is that okay. normal with you? Yeah. Okay. Are you taking any medicine for that? No, because if I take any medicine, the next month I feel... Mm, I get worse. Si yo tomo medicina al siguiente mes, me duele más. Yes, so if I take medicine, the following month is worse. Following, the following month, it, it works? It's worse. It's worse. Okay. Yes, it's worse. Okay. All right, so let's return to the main session. Okay. Okay. All right, did you finish practicing uh, that conversation, that exercise? Yes. <clears throat> All right. Did everybody have the chance to practice? Yes, no, maybe. Yes. All right. So now we go with our yes. last activity, which is going to be a conversation. Let me let me show it to you. Share. Do you see the image? It's very yeah. Okay. Where is this conversation? This one do you prefer? at the department store. Uh, which department exactly? Okay. Department? What is it? Wh which department, uh, Pamela? Men's department. Men's department? No. Uh, who said the no? The third department. What? Okay, okay, but is that Ladies. men's or, or women's department? Ladies woman. department? Uh-huh. Uh, ladies. Women's department. Woman department. Yeah. yeah, ladies department, women's department, uh, because they're asking prices about jackets. Uh, do you like jackets? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. All right. Not too much, but I don't. <laughs> All right. So, what's the name of the conversation? Which one do you prefer? Now, which one do you prefer? Now, we also we already mentioned that one is making reference to something that we previously mentioned. So, I'm going to read the conversation one time. You guys pay attention for pronunciation, or if you have any questions about meaning. You guys let me know when I finish. Now, here we go. Look, these jackets are really nice. Which one do you prefer? I like the wool one better. The wool one, why? It looks warmer. Well, I like the, well, the leather one better. It's more stylish than the wool one. Hmm, there's no price tag. Uh, excuse me, how much is this jacket? It's $499. Would you like to try it on? Uh, no, 
think. Uh, no, that's okay. But thanks anyway. You're welcome. You're welcome. All right. Any questions about meaning or pronunciation? What's meaning? Wool meaning. Wool. Does anybody know wool. the meaning of wool? Anybody knows wool? Puede usted. Wool. You. Puede usted. O le gustaría ir a probársela? Okay. Wool is, is making oh, yeah. reference to material. It means lana. 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 How about silk? Okay, silk is seda. Oh, thanks. Yes. Leather. Leather. One. Leather is cuero. Cuero. Leather. Yes. What does mean warmer? Warmer. warmer. Más caliente. Más caliente. Más caliente. Oh, okay. Because no. warm, warm is caliente. Warmer. It's warmer, not caliente. caliente. Yeah. caliente. Uh huh. What else? I'm better. What else? What else? What is the meaning? What is the meaning for wool? What did you say? Uh, lana. Lana. Okay. Yes. Lana. Any others? No. All right. I need no. I need two volunteers. Oh, actually, I need three people. I need Anne, Sue, and the clerk. Anne, where are you? Me, teacher. All right. Good. Sue. I will be Sue. Okay, I will be Sue. Good. And the clerk. Me. Me. All right, good. So, one, two, three. Lights, camera, action. Look, these jackets are really nice. Which one do you prefer? I like the wool, no one better. The wool one? Why? It looks warmer. Well, I like the leather one better. It's more stylish than the wool one. Mm, there's no price tag. Excuse me, how much is this is is this jacket? It's four hundred ninety nine dollars. Would you like to try it on? Oh no, that's okay. But thanks anyway. You're welcome. All right, uh, good. Voy a regresarlo. <laughs> I will come back. <laughs> ya no me gustó. <laughs> I will come back. <laughs> right. All right. Anybody else wants to give it a try and, and, and read? I need three other volunteers. I will I be Anne. Anne this time. Okay, you're Anne. Okay, then. Uh huh. I'm Sue. Okay, you're Sue. And where's the clerk? I, uh, I will be the clerk. Me. This time. Okay, Andy, you're the cleric. Okay, so okay. Alan, you're in. Uh, who, who said it was going to be Sue? Me, Andy. Okay, Andy. And the cleric? I am uh, clerk. Me. Okay, all right, all right, good. So, one, two, three, go. Look, the jacket are really nice. Which one do you prefer? I like the woolen one better. The wool one? Why? It looks warmer. It looks... Oh, well, I like the leather one better. It's more stylish than the wool one. Mm, there's no price tag. Excuse me, how much is this jacket? It's $499. Would you like to try it in on? Oh. No, that's okay, but thanks anyway. You're welcome. <laughs> I will <All> right. come back. <laughs> <laughs> Has that ever happened to you? You go to a store and you ask for something and the price is too high? Yes. Yeah. And, and, and what, is, what, is your, what is your reaction 
with the people of the store. Kind of really. <laughs> it's uh -huh. very expensive. Yeah. Or maybe a poker face that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's it's true. Uh, sometimes we hear a price that we're not expecting, so we're like, we get kind of surprised, and uh, we said, "Okay, thanks. I'll come back." I'm poor. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah, Any... my heart, poor. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I came to the wrong place. <laughs> yeah. Who, wh right. Where is that rooster? <laughs> mine is time. sleeping, man. He's waking up. It's mine. It may be mine. No, no, it's not mine. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Good. Um, are there any questions about this conversation? No. No? Any questions about the platform or anything that you may want to ask? No. 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 All right. So we're going to stop right here. Uh, I will see you tomorrow. Same place, same time. Thank you for your time. Thank you for making the space. And have a good night. Thank you. Good night. All right. Bye. 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 See you later. Oh, teacher, excuse me. Bye. Can I tell? Yes. Can I tell uh, something to the group? Yeah. Sure. Yes, uh, uh, guys, uh, I have a new job. So then the people that, uh, the person who, who hired me, it's looking for more, for more customer service agents. And, and it needs uh, a 65% about English. And this is no hike uh, for us, right? And if someone want to try to be hired or, or apply for the, for the requirement, I can refer. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thank you. Well, if you're interested in working uh, in an English account, contact Alan and he'll give you the details. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, Thank you. It, and the level is no high for us. But remember that it's a, a seven sixty-five percent only. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Good. Thank you. It's Thank you. For... All right. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Alan. Bye. Have a good night, everybody. You're welcome. Bye. Have a good night, everybody. Bye.